Welcome back guys. So it's sometime in the evening. Um, we're down here getting ready to put a few cows through the chute. Um, as I said in an earlier video there, we're doing uh, two preg checks and trimming number one, Malls' uh, feet. And yeah, who's the cows are checking? Uh, 17, 19. So 17 uh, was preg checked by the vet. Supposed to be pregnant, but we're pretty sure she's still open. But hopefully not, hopefully we're wrong. Um, 19 is a one year old calf uh, heifer and she looks like she's starting to make bag and uh, she would have been around, well she would have been at, at the latest six months old when she got bred last year on pasture. Um, so anyway, we're gonna check her and yeah, do Moses this week. So anyway, we're gonna get you guys set up here and get started. Did you want a glove? Grab me the stick that's up in the chute. In the chute, in the chute, in the chute. In the chute, get that one. So there's her bag. Not much of a bag, but mind you, she's not that old either. So and she's got a pretty good gut on her. So for a yearling. Do you have any 
Lubertitis? No time for that. So you go through the rectum. Is she? Confirmed pregnancy on number 17. No, 19. 19, sorry. Twas not planned, but man, she just, that's just the way she goes. Hey, Jess? Hey, Jess? Yeah. Jess? Okay. So this is the cow, number 17. She should be a first time calver. And we're thinking that she's not pregnant. And if she's not, she'll be getting shipped because she had been running with the bull uh, all summer all fall and all winter um, right up until the cow started to calve when we pulled the bull out so um, that means if she hasn't caught by then she isn't gonna catch so she'd be getting shipped and, she, and she's due no there's no this is not due next month that's for sure she's due in a month and <laughs> So she'll be getting put on the truck next week. Next week. See you later, girl. Get up in there. Come on. 
Come on, boss. All right, guys. Well, that cow there, that's Malls number one. And uh, as I figured, she's just too hefty for the uh, for the shoot here. She does not fit. She's about six inches out each side. <laughs> too big. So, which is too bad. Um, she really needs to get her feet done. So. But we got the two pregnancy treks done and it's as we figured the one is pregnant and the one isn't so but uh, anyway just the way she she goes so um, yeah now we're just trying to think of what to do uh, with malls uh, my father-in-law has same kind of shoot, different style, and I think it's actually wider. Um, so that's that's an option, is to uh, is to actually go and get it. I'll take a measurement on this one, and we'll go measure the other one, and uh, and see, and if it's eight ten inches wider than this one. We would uh, we'd be ready to to go. So, but um, like we said, uh, cows will be going out on pasture tomorrow morning. So we'll just have to try and get her back in here if we can get that other shoot and go from there. So and as for number nineteen. Um, Judging by when we took the bull out, or when we put her in the barn, sorry, not when we took the bull out, but when we separated her from the bull uh, last fall, she should be due, well, the latest, when's the latest she'd be due? July. The latest she'd be due is July. So she probably won't be probably won't be calving until uh, late June July I'm thinking but you just never know it's hard to say when she actually caught so but anyway so as usual guys make sure you hit that uh, thumbs up button and if you haven't already done so subscribe to the channel and leave us a comment and make sure you guys share the video tell your friends tell your family tell the world anyway guys peace out